Alrighty, good morning everyone and welcome back to Euro Truck Simulator 2 and um, welcome back to Finland somewhere we are, no idea. And um, last time I um, set some values in the options to zero in order to stop the truck from shaking as there was no trailers connected. Um, turns it was the suspension stiffness and the cabin stiffness. And turns out you don't have to um, touch the cabin stiffness, you only have to adjust the suspension systems it's a little bit weird because um it's it seems like it starts to um to shake as soon as as is bigger than zero no it's not you can see 10 percent seems to be okay is there a slight wobble that i probably don't see no okay now let's see how far we can get this um, up before. Let's just put it to 50. Okay, 75. What about 99? Maybe it's just not supposed to be 100. Okay. Good, um, we have to rest in two hours, which means we can look for a job. Okay, then let's do that. Let's see what our expansion of new towns that we have discovered here, you see, will give us. Ulu, what do we have? Uh, Uppsala. Cool. That's not bad. Okay. Yes, that's not going to be very nice. Good. Drive safe. Let's see how can we get out of here? Uh, there, somewhere. Okay. Oh right, I have my superior knob. I feel like it's shaking a bit now. Yes. Is that the engine? It's very, very, very weird. I, I tell you what we do. We put this to zero. And when we have the trailer connected, we put this back to 100. Good. Okay. Then let's um, get out of here. Okay. Um, why is our... E? Didn't I click continue? Time to hit the road. Uh, oh, is it here directly? Maybe. Ah, yeah. <laughs> mm, at least it um, keeps our way short. Good. Frozen Hake, whatever that is, to Uppsala. Okay, take job. Yes. Time to get the job done. Traders, okay. Over there, okay. Uh, okay. Let's try to get this. Oh, wow. Um. Um. Uh, okay, that's not very good. Wait, let's try to cheat again. We had this issue before. And in this, that case, we simply... Much, much, much later. Okay. okay. Here we go. That was very unprofessional, but... Um, okay. So, no idea how we are supposed to get out of here. Let's try. Oh, right, we wanted to... This is a bit annoying and tiresome, but um, okay, let's... Let's do this. Let's do this. There's someone coming. Mm. Turn 
right. Yep. I try to. Um, this is as close to the wall as I can get. Oh, I just made it out. Just made it out. Whew. Okay. <laughs> very, very, very bad. <sighs> okay, and then we have to fill up and we have to rest. Correct. Go straight on. Oh, straight on. Okay. Okay, then let's look where we where can we rest here. Let's go. Go straight on. And See, the corner doesn't look too tight. Seems like it's possible here. But if you only get these jobs with the articulated trailers now, that's pretty bad. And these extremely heavy ones too. Okay, let's merge on the highway here. There's this weird structure again. What is that? Oh, wait, I have to take a picture. Anyway. Oh, there's the um, petrol sla station slash rest place. Okay. Uh, that's. Uh, thank God we don't have a very big. Ooh, dude, slow down. Thank God it's not a very big truck that we're having. Rear computer. This is 191. That's really bad. Ooh, okay. Da -da 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 -da. Wow. And thirty two thousand six hundred. Great. Hey, rest stop. Okay, then let's um, rest here real quick. And loan installment. And we are back to 31,900. Cool. Good. It's basically the same way we got here, I think. Uh, where are we going? We're going to Uppsala, right? Yeah, yeah. we we passed Uppsala. We haven't been there, but we passed it. Next rest stop in eight hours. We have to do one more anyway. And um, But we have 31 hours for the job. That's okay. Oh, then let's see. Um... It's not slowing it's not slowing down by itself you have to hit the brakes the cruise control cannot there's a police the car Take the second exit. yeah i'm trying exit now okay Really be careful with these giant articulated trailers. Take the second exit. Okay. Uh, cool building. Exit now. Okay, I'm really careful not trying to mow down any lamppost road signs or whatsoever. Good. Um, 
27 tons, wow. That's very, very heavy. Ah, yeah, we really, really need to upgrade um, the engine of this truck. If you want to continue these heavy loads. And let's face it, the most profitable ones were, I think, heavy loads. In my main account, I'm doing a lot of these uh, medical vaccines and that stuff. That's also very... That's fragile cargo, I think, and these are oftentimes lighter. So, yeah. Yeah, this is now we're going on slightly uphill, and um, as you can see in the um, current fuel consumption, 112, we are on absolute maximum throttle. Mm, yeah, not good. And um, so I checked with the engines because last time I said I wanted to upgrade. Um, the 480 horsepower engine is available, I think, from level 16. And the 530 horsepower engine is available as of level 18. So, mm, it's still a while. Uh, you see there's a town that we haven't discovered. Go straight on. I don't really want to go in there now. Uh, not really, no. Okay, then, um, Ooh, nice leak. It's, and it's so nice that these, the high traffic density or high density traffic mod isn't there anymore. Because I can just drive here without being crashed into um, forced to break down or anything. That is very, very nice. Okay, let's see. We have to rest in seven hours. Okay, then let's see where can we do that. This is a hotel, maybe. In seven hours. Okay. Ready to roll. Let's see if we can. I hope this works out. I mean, last time with the, with the long trailer, we managed to get out of the hotel. Parking lot just fine. Hmm. Interesting vegetation here. I like this, this thickness of the grass and everything. Wow. Ooh, big town. Ah, Tordemio. Ah, that, ah, that was the border, I think. That was the border town between Sweden and Finland. I think, but well, it's definitely going to go slow there. to maneuver here without crashing into anyone because Exit nobody else now. is of course okay go that looks um, as if we were successful a lot of traffic here well not that much but hey Ikea there's a border in Sweden okay 
we back in Haparanda. Or whatever. Ha -ha -ha Haparanda. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Okay, taking the second exit. Thank God there's no one here now. Exit now. Okay. And 70. Nice. And driving in the north here is pretty nice for the most part. I mean, really nice scenery and um, not so much traffic actually. Um, but these um, prices for diesel here, 190. That is really, really bad. I have to try to get back to um, to Central Europe. You've seen the jobs that we get in Berlin and Frankfurt. They're really, really good. I would like to get back to um, back to Germany somehow. We have to um, find our way back south somehow. Maybe prioritize jobs that go to the south, and then somehow get back to um, to Central Europe again. And there's a nice church. Oh, right. Yes, of course. Um, 50 here. At the roundabout, take the second exit. I'm taking the second exit. Okay, no. Road exit sign? Now. Oh, nice. Uh, road sign there, okay. Passed that successfully. Mm. Traffic cones looks good. Nice. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Taking the first exit, okay. Exit now. Yeah, you can feel the um, suspension stiffness. The truck is no longer so wobbly. It's really, really nice. Uh, yeah, weird that you have to turn that off and um, that the truck is shaking like crazy. If you don't... Um, yeah. Hmm. Don't know. No idea what that's all about. I don't... I have tried to find anything about that. Like, maybe if other people had the problem... But it seems like I'm the only one, so I, I couldn't find any information about that. Maybe it's a combination of mods that's responsible for that. It could also be like a car mod or anything like that that's, that's causing this. Uh, no idea. But I have a way around that now, so that's okay. Good thing we can coast for a while. Sunswal, 587. Mm. We're going further than that. Wow, going almost 800. Rene Elf. Mm, nice. Oh, two lanes become one again. A very nice and relaxed um, drive so far. Um, fuel consumption is even going down. 34.4, I think we picked this up to 34.6 or something. Hmm. Interesting, but if you... Ah, here's Notficken. 
But if you um, if you're able to just drive for a while, just just not this permanent stop and go, then yeah, fuel consumption goes down, even with a 27-ton trailer. Volkswagen Passat. New one coming out now, I heard. Not really my favorite kind of bird, to be honest. Well, it's actually more like in the um, bottom half. But it's supposed to be a very nice workhorse. A lot of people have trust in that, and I know a lot of them who do. But I also know some that moved off of it. And he isn't leaving us already. Okay. Going to some other place, apparently. Is there another alien detector building here? No. I thought I saw something. Oh, there's a probably a communication tower. Hmm. Oh, this is so nice here. Yes. This is very nice. He's going to Paitia. Hmm. And that's okay. Um, yeah, it's, now it's a two lane again. Yeah, that's basically the entire way back again. Except that we are now stopping in Uppsala. We did on our, on our way back to, to Sweden here from Denmark. Where we delivered the tires, we didn't stop at Uppsala, I just saw it. And um, this time we can, that's really good. Keep right. Yep. If you pull out now, it's motherfucker, you stupid asshole. Left Kumun. Nice. Ah. Roadworks. Damn. Nobody working here, of course. Just making the road tighter. Good idea. It's in the evening already. Shit. Didn't really realize that. I was sleeping all day. Very, very beautiful scenery here. I like these forests. Up here in the north. I like every scenery a little bit like it's really cool that we have such a big variety of scenery here and then ETS like to go. Is it, can we go left here? Yes. Because the go people who want to go left have their own lane, right? Not. So they will most likely block us off then. Okay, let's wait here. 
don't see anything. There we go, where the others go. Wow, pure acceleration here. Zero to twenty in two hundred minutes. There's a roundabout somewhere. Oh, they're all going there. What is there? Whoa, wait. Oh, 70. Ah, there's a roundabout. No! I have to go over. The right lane um, turned out to be better for roundabouts. Although this is all just for the um, high density the traffic mod. Take the second exit. Here it's actually pretty okay. Exit now. Right. Ooh, struggling uphill here. I'm not really sure what the effects of the different chassis though. Like they're they saying like for heavy cargo the chassis with the six axes, uh, with the three axes is better and all that. I have no idea Keep how running. this yeah. How this exactly is better. Maybe it prevents the truck from moving around so much if you have a heavy trailer connected. Because there's more weight on two axes at the back. Um Oh, there's a speed camera. Go straight on. Okay. Um. But they, if you have these, these three axes, they all have so tiny fuel tanks, like really, like only like 400 liters or something like that, which gives you a range of I don't know, 800 kilometers or something. It's really, really bad. I mean, this was now the first time that we filled this thing up at all. Like, and we have already done 3,000 kilometers with it. So, um, I think, I'm not sure, but I think. So, yeah. Don't really know if this is um, such an advantage. But then again, I mean, you have to um, stop and rest pretty often anyway, so. Speed camera. Okay, there was no speed limit here. Oh, yes, that was not for us still. There's a speed camera. Will it catch us? No. Okay. Keep right and then continue straight on. That's what we're going to do. I think there is Eddie again. Go straight on. Yep. Okay. How long to our rest stop? 141 kilometers. 140 kilometers, 600 is 460. Okay. At 460 kilometers. And then we sleep all night. Cool. Now that we have the... Um, now that I have gotten rid of the high density traffic mod, I am enjoying, looking forward to driving uh, during the day more. Oh, interesting. Hole in the guardrail. So that's nice. Uy, uy, uy.
good. Another roundabout. Oh, that's nice. Let's slow down. I'm not really in a hurry here. This isn't an urgent delivery. And there's a 50. Right. Take the second exit. Taking the second exit. Okay. Ooh, nice. Exit now. Yep. I don't have to accelerate that much though. Because there's the next roundabout already waiting for us. And we're not executing uh, going um leaving it at the second exit. Ooh, nice sun. Going to the centrum. Okay. At the roundabout, take the third exit. Okay, the third. Now this is going to be interesting this time. Okay. Thank God there's no other car now. Exit now. Hmm. That went well. Good. 100 kilometers until the rest stop. 70 here, okay. Interesting. Ooh, nice town. Oh, 50. Mm. Go straight on. I'm going straight on. If this metro transit here lets me. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, this is so nice with all the traffic. Oh. Really, really nice. But there's another roundabout, so the 70 here is. Um, yeah. Not worth it. Huge. But we are getting closer to our rest stop. At the roundabout. Take the first exit. We're not indicating when we enter in the roundabout. Exit now. Oh, 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 oh. Roadside, lamppost. Okay. Whew. Instruments seem to be a bit dark now. But usually it's okay at night. It's just if the... Just during the day that it's um uh, well night there's not really not really a lot of night here. Oh 80. I think now we can proceed directly to the rest stop. Just in mm, 70 kilometers, I think. I think this is this could be no. It's not over. But we can probably Oh it's on the other side. No. That's not ours. But it's directly next to the road here. It's actually way more convenient. Um hmm. I think I'm using this one. I don't have to maneuver through any town or anything. It's, it's way better. Yes, I'm using this one. Finding a new route. No, we don't have to. Yes, it works. Nice. It's enough space for one, isn't there? <laughs> Wait. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> okay, then let's rest.
Okay, that's it for this episode then. Then we continue this in the next one. Until then, take care and the tschüss.